business stories now. Dubai Islamic Bank is spreading its tentacles in the coastal region, even as the bank ramps up its expansion drive in Kenya. The move is expected to heighten competition in the area, which has predominantly had a select few of banks, namely Gulf African Bank and First Community Bank. Despite a number of Kenyan banks shedding off staff, the entry of DIB is a welcome relief for bankers. Kenya's banking sector is currently facing turbulent times as access to loans have shrunk following the rate cap, which has in recent days seen President Uhuru Kenyatta rooting for its repeal. Speaking during the launch, the bank CEO Peter Macau notes that Kenya is still a robust market to invest in, sentiments which were echoed by Mohamed Faki, Mombasa County's senator. The, the uh, trade outlet, not only for Kenya, but for the whole of the East African region. When you look at Mombasa, it is a very vibrant market. There are a lot of goods that are being traded from Dubai, where our head office is. A lot of goods that are coming in from Pakistan, where we also have operations. And we'd like to encourage our customers to use our branch network to, uh, to facilitate trade activities between Kenya and countries like uh, United Arab Emirates and Pakistan. The county government, uh, through the finance executive who is here, that they should come up now with more policy fr friendly policies that will uh, encourage business people to come and invest in Mombasa. Because that's why it's the only way we are going to deal with the, the problem of the SGR and other economic problems that are, are affecting us. I know at the moment the security situation has improved and we wish that it should now be better so that people can do, go about their businesses. Even a 24-hour economy should be able to function in Mombasa if we have adequate security. Well, 